Guys, this is so easy to avoid the trap if you just instantly recognize we can arithmetize here. Notice what they did. They gave us the radiuses of two triangles, uh, <laughs> circles. Well, let's make sure we know what shapes we're dealing with. There's radiuses of two circles. And they deliberately made them annoying by doing 3n and 129n. But if you just had a normal number, all of this is stuff you can do in the calculator, right? So why don't we just make n1 and then think about it that way, right? 3 is the radius of one of them and 129 is the radius of the other. Now we can use the circle area formula, which you should memorize as pi r squared, but it is in the reference chart if you need it. And now we can just do circle A and circle B. So A is going to be pi times three squared, that's nine pi, and B is going to be pi times 129 squared. So I don't know that one off the top of my head, but 129 squared is 16641 pi. Right, so how many times greater is it? Well, just divide at this point, right? Divide the 16,641 by nine. Technically, the pies are along for the ride, but we know they're gonna cancel and just kind of work themselves out. So I'm just gonna do regular divide by nine in this calculator, and I get that they are 1849 different, that's D. And I probably could have just guessed that based on the, the big difference in the numbers, right? 16,641 is a huge difference from nine, right? So you probably could have figured that out but it doesn't hurt to just do it. Regardless, I just, yes, it's not that much harder to do it with the ends, but I'm just thinking about other questions where there's more things going on. You just have to have that impulse of like, they've they've twisted this question up. If they just asked you about it with a radius of three and a radius of 129, this would be a basic question. There'd be almost no challenge at all. But they know that by throwing that N in there, they might get some people to make an error that they wouldn't otherwise make. So don't open the door to that. Don't let them get you that way bring it back to the thing you want. Bring it back to normal distances and it'll be much easier to solve and think about and there's really just no doubt at all.